I must say that neonatal ventilation is by far the most challenged situation for an anesthesiologist. Uh, the problem is that the physiology is totally different and accuracy in this case is absolutely mandatory. Uh, accuracy in the tidal volume you are delivering in these cases is uh, the most important thing and accuracy in measure flows and pressure should be very, very, very important because other any variation in adults, it doesn't have too much problem, clinical problem, but in neonates, it's, it's a clinical problem every time. In pediatric and neonatal ventilation, the accuracy and precision of ventilation are very important. This has also been um, considered during the design phase of our anesthesia devices. In Primus and Apollo, we have integrated several aspects that contribute to this. First of all, we have fresh gas decoupling, which means that you have um, the independency between fresh gas delivery and ventilation. Then we have an electronic ventilator integrated, which gives highest accuracy in tidal volume delivery independent from any flow measurement. We do have, in addition, integrated monitoring, continuous monitoring of flow and pressure, which gives the anesthesiologist at any time the monitoring that is required. And we have integrated gas measurement. So you have directly on screen inspiratory and expiratory values for um, gases, oxygen and volatile agent, and continuous monitoring um, of CO2 in a waveform. I'm a pediatric anesthesiologist with more than 14 years of background, and I must say that it's time to have to ventilate a preterm baby or a neonate is a real challenge situation. So to have the opportunity to ventilate those patients with a machine with a high accuracy in measure of flow, pressure, and tidal volume is something that gives you a lot of confidence.